Friday, 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 Friday. Not that I have any plans and I gotta go to work. Uh, it's Friday. That's all. That's all that's it. So, happy Friday to you guys. Hope everybody have a beautiful Friday. I'm up, waiting for Pretty Princess so I can take her to school. Um, about to get me some coffee. Okay, to start my day. I have no more bananas to eat for breakfast. So, I don't know what I'm gonna eat with the, uh, with my breakfast this morning. Maybe I'll have a mango, cause I got two over here and I don't want them to go bad. Um, maybe I will cut it up, put it in a bowl, add some tea gin, and voila. Voila. I have no more cake cups, so. <clears throat> And I'm trying not to buy no more cake cups. I'm going to splurge and buy any because I have a lot of ground coffee that I keep not using. So I'm going to use until I run out. No more waste because I need a K cup. I don't need a K cup. Okay. So today's coffee, and this will be my coffee for a bit, is a. Uh, Kamba Rooms, Toasted Southern Pecan Coffee. I don't know where I got this from. I know I probably got it because of the Toasted Southern Pecan and I like um, my coffee to have a hint of like buttery, nutty notes. So maybe I got it from uh, Marshalls or one of them, I don't know, but I'm gonna use this coffee till I can't till it's all gone, okay? And then once I use it till it's all gone, I think I got another one. Uh, I think I got Blue Mountain Coffee from Jamaica that I can use, so I'll be using that, not wasting. So, do you believe this shirt? Do you think staying is staying in is the new going out? I want to go out. <laughs> Thinking about like going to a bar today. Not really a bar bar, but a bar lounge type place that serves like drinks, adult beverages. And maybe eating an appetizer or two. Thinking that's what I should do. Today's supposed to be nice. I'm tired of sitting in the house. Um, I want to dress up and look cute. So I may do that. I may do that. Take advantage of this nice weather. What do you buy a side plate? Let a system know. Let me know what y'all is doing. What y'all doing? Um, I think I'm gonna get up tomorrow morning and go and do my oil change. Cause I don't want to sleep later on Sunday before returning to work Monday. So I may just go tomorrow and get my all change and call it a day. I think that would be my smart thing to do. This eye, I tell you, this eye is just water, 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 water. Not sure why, but I is always crying. And I be treating the eyes good. But for whatever reason, you just want to cry. I don't know. Today, I don't think I'm cooking. Friday, what am I cooking? 
I don't think I'm cooking. I cook for the majority of the week. This week, yesterday, we did like a leftover. And I had the uh, last macaroni and cheese that I had gotten from Trader Joe's. Uh, that mac and cheese is, it's all right. It's not something that I would get again from Trader Joe's. And I tried like three different flavors. So, I'm going to test. You ready? The what? Coffee. What coffee? Okay. Go get it. Anywho, it's not something that I would try again. It's not better than Stouffer's. So if you like Stouffer's mac and cheese, which is the bombdiggity.com, then it ain't that. My opinion, I'm entitled. So, I'm going to get ready and give her a lesson so we can get out of here. Because, of course, we're like four minutes late. Leaving the house and she still didn't walk the door. Okay. Okay. And I'll wake up at six. At six. So she has a lot of time to get ready. But, you know, they move slow. But anywho, I'm going to catch you guys a little later today. Yes? Yes. Have a good one. Hey love bugs, how y'all doing today? Hope everybody's doing good. Happy Friday, happy Friday, happy Friday. Coming on just to do a quick little Amazon haul. Uh, just to show you what I got, what I thought was cute, um, that I saw and that I wanted. So for this coming spring, summer month, I'm really into a statement blouse. Like something that is just, you know, something that you'll look and do a double take so I found this cute little cotton um, blouse puff sleeve off the shoulder because I love an off the shoulder um, blouse it's a uh, attached belt on one side so you wrap it all the way around this is what it looks like I think it's so cute you can throw this on with a pair of jeans a cute little um, a cute little skirt or a pair of slacks or a pair of shorts. I thought it was really cute. Um, I'm loving the puff sleeves on this um, blouse. I think it came in black, but I'm not sure. Don't quote me. All the information will be listed in the description box. Um, yeah, I really like this blouse. I'm pleasantly surprised on this blouse um i will also put the size in the box in the description box as well so him back with another little number two piece outfit i saw this pop up on my amazon feed as a recommendation based on whatever else i've purchased in the past but i thought this was so cute um it does come in other colors but i chose this beautiful orange uh the pants leg come down very nice to, it's not too long, the pants leg is not dry, not dragging. Um, so like if I had to wear slides, which nine out of 10 times I would be wearing slides, it, um, it's not, it's not dragging. I like the high splits on each side of the leg. The pants are elastic. This string is functional. This cute little ruffle top very cute, very cute. I actually took this with me on vacation on my last trip, but I didn't get to wear it. Um, I was gonna use it as a, a cover up or wear it in the evening because I had a swimsuit um, that I wanted to pair it with, but I wound up not even uh, wearing it. The tags are still on it, as you can see, tags are still on there. But I thought this was so cute. You just, uh throw it on and here you go this is what I look like from the back this is what I look like from the side yes I think it's very cute and it does come in other colors I don't recall the colors again all the information along with sizes will be in the description box now in my past vlogs I did tell you that I was ready for the beach right I'm ready for the beach I got this cute little two-piece 
swimsuit from Amazon. Yes, Amazon. Do you see the detailing in the back? Do you see the color? The color is just like pow, pow, orange. It does come in other colors. Um, it does come in like print bottoms and a solid top, but I love the color orange, particularly in the summer months. You could wear it down, show a little shoulder action, you know. Um, however you choose to wear it, you can wear it. It's so cute. It's comfortable. It's mom friendly. It's not showing too much. Uh, this is definitely a cute, very cute a uh, swimsuit and it feels so comfortable very comfortable and you know as i told you I always remove the little uh pads inside because i feel i got enough boobage without any added extras needed this is definitely a beautiful swimsuit so i'm back yes with another swimsuit i told you i got a swimsuit for every day of the hot months um this is so cute off the shoulder lace with the little peak, give you a little peak action going on. This is what I look like from the back. It is indeed mom friendly on the beach, at the pool. This is so beautiful. I love the color. Um, it really pops against my skin. It pop even better if I'm outside in the sun, okay? Hint, hint, take me to the beach. Take me to the beach, okay? Um, I'm gonna close out this vlog, well, this portion of the vlog. Um, with some cute little pool slides that I got um, that I thought was cute that came up again as a recommendation I need to stay off of Amazon I really need to like stay off a lot of different sites but Amazon has everything that you can think you want but don't really want but you get anyway but these are cute these are cute little pool slide it has the camo design very cute very cute just stick your foot in and just go and these are by eco cozy and then i got another print um this one is like an animal print very cute very cute uh they're really comfortable um i'm sure they came uh, yeah they came in other colors and I think they came in one or two other prints as well, but they're so nice. They're just so nice. And I'm going to be ready this summer just to be here, there, and everywhere. Um, if you see me out in the streets, say hi. I'll say hi back. Um, and yeah, I'm going to talk to you guys a little later. Smooch, smooch. Hey love vlogs, I'm about to head out for the evening. I'm going to have drinks at this bar in my town. Um, just feel like getting out the house. The weather is beautiful, so why not, right? Um, I just threw something on together. Not nothing. Hey love bugs. Happy Saturday. Happy Saturday. Happy Saturday. I am heading to go get dinner for me and Pretty Princess. She didn't get back yet. Ugh. Um, she had a step team competition today. Somewhere in Newark. So she's been gone since 1030 this morning. It is now 20 minutes to 7. And I just hit her up to see if she was on her way back home, but she said no. So, I'm just going to go and get the food because I'm hungry. I can't wait for her to get back to me. Got to figure out the food or whatever. I'm just going to go run and get it real quick and come back home and eat and still wait until whenever she gets home. Today in New Jersey, the sun tried to do its best to peek through a bit as much as it can, but you know, it's 63 degrees as of now. There's a little chill in the air. It's overcast. It is what it is. Hope everybody, yeah. Hope everybody had a lovely Sunday. Sunday, the Saturday. 
because it is still Saturday, tomorrow Sunday. Hope everybody had a lovely uh, Sunday, Sunday. Dara, Saturday, sorry. And whatever you did, you did safely. I'm hungry. See, you would think I didn't eat today. I had a bagel, started off my day with a bagel. And what else did I have? Oh, I had um, a slice of pizza from my pa favorite pizzeria here in, in New Jersey. Well, in my town. But now I'm hungry again. So I am going to eat some Chinese. At least that's what I felt like eating today. been really a quiet day today I felt a little lonely felt a little lonely today I was actually missing Mr. B doesn't happen often um, but today I did miss him I told him to he said he missed me but you know we all know anyhow Hopefully, he'll be home on Thursday. Hopefully, hopefully, but uh, we don't know. So, I'm going to let you good people go. Hope everybody has a wonderful Saturday night. Should have went out. Get a drink or two. not I'm just gonna stay in the house and chill I've been uh, on Netflix so I've been Netflixing and chilling and what's the one for Hulu Hulu and sipping but I haven't been sipping so I don't know what do you want to call it But I'm gonna watch it Hulu, like catching up on my uh, TV programs, like uh, a million little things. Um, what else is the other one? Uh, what is the other one? My favorite show. It's in its final season. Oh my God! What is that show? With Jack and Randall. Beth, what is the name of the show? Oh my god, I don't remember, but I love that show. Hopefully you guys know what I'm talking about. If you do, drop it down below. I love that show. And it's his final season, so it's not going to come back on. Which sucks. The roads are so bumpy. Just bumpy. Bumpy road! But I'm going to catch you guys later. Mooha, mooha, mooha. Remember to like my video. Hey, love bugs. Happy Sunday to you guys. Hope everybody's doing good. I am doing good. Uh, waiting for my son to come out. Um, he needed a lift from his little side hustle job on the weekends, the golf course here in Maplewood, uh, New Jersey. So I'm waiting for him to come out. And I'm gonna go back home and finish cleaning my room, my bedroom. I'm trying to clean my bedroom while I feel I have some energy, put like some clothes away. Um, get rid of another bag of clothes that the lady picked up two bags yesterday. I already starting a new bag. So um, I wanna clean my bedroom and I wanna clean my master bath today. Well, that's what's on my agenda. I don't know what I'm going to do for dinner. I did take out some sausages to cook. But I don't know. I don't feel I don't feel for that. So I, I don't really have a taste for anything in particular. But um, I don't feel for that. So I got to rethink what I'm going to do. I feel like some fish, to be honest. But I'm not sure like what type of fish. Maybe some snapper 
or some whiting i'm not sure i gotta figure it out or maybe i just buy dinner again today and start off fresh tomorrow by cooking um this cute little dress which i will insert a picture somewhere over on the screen i got from amazon i actually have it also and a white with navy blue stripes um today's the first time i'm putting on this dress it fits so nice it didn't you know um i guess i really didn't ex did i expect it to fit nice i don't know but i thought it was cute because it came up as a recommendation so um i bought this color and then i got the white with the navy blue stripes but oh this is a nice summer dress uh spring summer dress that i can wear it's like three three quarter sleeves but fit very nice and it has pockets so you, you know you put your hands in your pocket or put stuff in your pocket if you want to um what else that's it tomorrow's monday start of a new week um you know it's almost the end of april the months just fly by so quickly i am trying to edit the uh shein uh vlog it is so long so i'm trying to edit and add some stuff to that uh vlog it's just going to be a shein vlog from start to finish i'm not going to add like any additional to it like my daily vlogs or whatever because it's really long um all of the all of the items are fire though they're fire 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 particularly like if you're going on vacation you got to get a, a couple of pieces if you can't get all get a couple um so i'm in the midst of doing that it's like i keep starting and then stopping and starting and stopping um what else and that's about it so it's a beautiful day here in new jersey temperatures reading 59 degrees the sun is out i got the moon roof open allowing a little sunshine in i love the warm months i i just love it i was trying to think maybe i should have went to like take my daughter to like olive garden for dinner tonight maybe we'll go to top's diner and have um some chicken and waffles or whatever else that she may want to eat so i may do that instead of cooking because it's such a beautiful day it's just too beautiful to sit in the house um yeah i kind of feel my son wants to borrow my car i kind of feel that but you know i'm not gonna put it in the atmosphere so anywho whatever you guys do today you do great have a blessed sunday um I love those Rubicons. I love those Rubicons. They're so expensive. Um, but I love them. Particularly like the hot weather. Oh my God. You know? I want a new car, but in the same sense, I don't want a... I don't want a car note. You know what it is when you don't pay no car, mo car note? A monthly car note? That's the only reason why I will not get a new car. Um, I'll just stick with my little car that I have I never went and got my oil change as it was supposed to I'm definitely going to do it next weekend I don't know I just didn't feel like it um sometimes it's just like that you know you feel like you're going to do something and then you're like uh, I don't feel like it so definitely during the week I can go during the week or I can um go on the weekend when I have more time and I'm not like pressed for time to uh do it unless i go like after work one day we'll see we'll see i'll check their hours and see if i can go like during the week or let it stay into the weekend these little golf courts are so just zipping through the parking lot just zipping through zip zip um and that's that so i see my beautiful necklace i got on that i'm always wearing i love this necklace i never take it off um i'm gonna say cheerio for now uh don't forget to like my video comment say hi i will say hi back don't be shy um subscribe to my channel it's rainbows and clouds peace
people are out with their little convertible tops down. I don't think it's a convertible top day, but who am I, right? Some people don't like it when it's all hot, hot. Uh, these little golf course are just, carts are just zipping through the parking lot. Um... That's that. I'm going to talk to you guys later. Smooch, smooch. Mm. Hey, love bugs. Happy Monday to you guys. Happy Monday. Hope everybody's doing good. You know what I got today in the mail? My Izzy and Liv box. Uh, my brown sugar box. It feels so heavy. It feels heavy. So let's see what goodies I got in the box. Hope everybody had a fabulous weekend. Just trying to position everything on my desk so stuff don't fall. Because I feel like stuff is going to fall. We don't want them to fall. I'm in my bathroom this morning. Had no meetings to attend. So I didn't feel to get dressed. You know, Mondays is my late day, so... I'm in no rush to get out of bed, be no rush to uh, have a meeting, an in-person meeting. So I'm like, <clears throat> I'm in my bathrobe today, right? I'm working. You know, when he's tapping on the keyboard, I'm working, I'm working. So let's see what's in the box. What's in the box? Canelo, what's in the box? Okay, you know, you get the brown sugar box catalog little brochure that has tons of pictures in it tons of articles things that you that may or may not be in, bo in your box um recipes uh advice for uh getting ahead advice for entrepreneurship advice for saving money it's just a lot of different things being this uh little catalog or whatever i really gotta go through the pictures because i want to see if i made a brochure yet so that's what's in here um i got what is this this is it looks like a little bag that says fearless let's open it and let's see It looks like a little lavender little purse that says fearless. It does have a strap. So it's a little purse that says fearless. Cute, cute. Um, very cute. Okay. What else did I get? I got a wall collage kit. Black girl illustrated wall collage kit. Um, 104 by 6 prints. Use as postcard. Yeah, use as postcards, wall art, or collect. So, I guess on the back of it, it tells you like different little um, postcards, four by six cards that's in there. So that's really cute. I can um, use these as postcards and drop in the mail and send to some friends. That is really cute. That's different. I like that. Say, hey, girl, hey. Right? I got a mug that says, living my life like it's golden, which is cute. A nice little coffee mug or a hot beverage mug. Very cute. I like it. I like it. I like it. And it's purple. Regal color. Um, I got a book by Gabrielle, Gabrielle Union called You Got Anything Stronger? Stories. Oh, interesting. Um, oh, nice little book. I intend to read this. Very nice. Um, I got this cute little notebook. I guess you can carry in your purse or a little journal type thing. Or, you know, you can write little notes, jot notes down. Pages are lined. 
very nice i like this pretty princess may take that knowing her i got a t-shirt see what my t-shirt says this month a nice pretty warm peach type color um it says oh wow strength it's not a t-shirt it's like a pajama shirt that says strength very nice oh, i like this i can wear this around the house with some black leggings very nice i like this very nice oh i really like it i like it i definitely will be using this definitely and i think last item in the box is the um bathrobe that i was supposed to get one i mean last month but uh i think they had manufacturing and shipping issues or whatever so they promised it would be in this box and it is in this box so it's a nice cute satin robe very nice you know i actually have one in my cart for amazon like a floral uh long one and this one looks like it's long instead of like the three quarter one so i'm going to keep this one and remove the one out of amazon This is very nice. I can't wait to wear this. So instead of this wintry one, which is like my husband's robe, which I wear all the time. It's like, oh, why do you have on my belt? Because I like it. Um, I will be about in this one this spring and summer once it gets a little warmer. Very nice. I like this. I'm going to put it in the bathroom on the back of the door. And that was all that was in my box. So don't forget subscribe to this box this is not a sponsored video um i think it's a nice box and whatever you get in the box uh if you don't want you can always give to somebody share because sharing is caring very nice um while i got you guys i'm going to do my quick three questions see a little tear like i'm crying for what i'm not crying eyes itching but i'm not crying okay i uploaded uh the shein vlog yesterday hopefully you guys got a chance to view if you didn't get a chance to view check it out uh all of the stuff i listed in the description box as long as well as the uh sizes okay so let's jump into my three questions for today one two three one thousand four hundred and forty five who is your favorite model? Oh, my favorite model is or was. I don't think I really have one now because there's like so many. Um, But I would say like back in the day, maybe Beverly Johnson. I thought she was so beautiful and she looked so gracious and regal she was like it was like i guess like the models back in the day taught me like you don't always have to be seen sometimes simple is more less is more and i live by that you know you can look beautiful simply without making a statement uh one two three question 1400 okay sorry yeah question 1400 what is something too hard for you to imagine what is something too hard for you to imagine oh um something happening to my children kudos to all those who have persevered persevered 
with something happening with their kids. Like, I just, I can't, I can't picture it. I can't imagine it. Um, I used to say that it would be hard to imagine, like, something happening to a spouse or whatever. But I, I went through that and I persevered and I got to the other side. Um, I used to say, like, something happening to my... One of my parents, um, my father passed away. So I went through that and I persevered and I was able to get to the other side. I used to say something happening to one of my siblings. Um, that is still a struggle. Um, when my younger sister passed away, still hits hard. Um, but I'm able to get to the other side. I don't know. Like, if something happened to one of my kids, like, I, I really don't know. I I don't even want to put that in the universe. That's just my answer to my question, to the question. And the final question of today is question 903. Name something you had a close call with. Mm, I would say death. I can say death. Um... And I'll give you a little mini story time. Uh, back. Yeah, I'm purposely like taking moments. Because this is like really deep. Um, I don't know if I was married yet. I don't think I was. I really don't remember. I, To be honest, I don't know if I was married or not. But I was with my son's father. And I had tried to commit suicide. Um, I had swallowed these pills. You know, me and him was going through some hard time. And I felt that I didn't want to be here. It's like, oh, well, I would say back then I didn't know my worth. Um, it's like I knew it, but in the same sense, I didn't. So I wasn't as confident as I am today. Um, but I swallowed some pills. Um, me and him was arguing and my son was around. My son was little. He was under the age of five, probably under the age of four. And we were arguing, arguing, arguing. And I felt that, you know, since I'm not good enough for you and you need to do whatever it is that you need to do, right? Um, and you want me to accept it, um, then I'm just gonna choose to leave the earth. So I swallowed these pills. There were some big horse-sized pills, capsules. They were just large. I swallowed the pills, and they didn't stay down. God was like, Penella, that's not the plan for you. That's not the plan that I have for you. So the pills did not stay down. I threw them back up. And when I realized it or whatever, you know, he started laughing at me. My son's father, I'm not sure if we were married again. I really don't remember. He was laughing at me. And I was like, why is he laughing at me? Like, I didn't understand it. Like, did he not know that this is what I was trying to do so he can love me? And... That day just, like, was a light bulb. Hey, girl, know who you are. Know your worth. You know, so you mean to tell me that you were going to off yourself and not be there for your kid, right? Does that make sense? It didn't make sense. That day I woke up. I woke up. And... You know, shout out to the people who 
feel like they can't go on on a daily basis because life is hard and, you know, they feel that they don't know their worth or, you know, they they don't know how they're going to make it from day to day. I'm just here to tell you and let you know. Um, you can do it. With prayer, have faith, you can do it. There's so many things I accomplished since then that I never thought in a million years. I never thought in a million years that I would be able to accomplish. <laughs> if you would have said that I would uh, have two college degrees, no. If you would have said I would have had a great job that I've been at, at for 15 years, no. If you would have said that I would have my own car, like I owned two cars in my lifetime, no. Um, without paying car notes, okay? I owned, own, currently own my second car. I owned my first car, which I sold. And I didn't have to sell it at a dealer to get way under what I wanted. I sold it to an outside uh, person and I got what I wanted for my car. Um, so when people say you can't do something, show them that you can. Use it as a, as a stepping stone and show them you got this. So, I'm going to sign off for now. Thanks for everybody for watching. Catch you in another video. Smooches.